Sam, for many years we've been hearing about the importance of agriculture, while on the other hand there's actually not that much investment taking place. What is your take on the situation with public and private investment? If you look at the Kenyan situation, agriculture directly contributes uh, to the GDP about 24% and an additional 27% indirectly through manufacturing, uh, distribution services linked to agriculture. So in a sense, if you look at it, uh, it's, it's about 50 plus contribution to the GDP. If you look at uh, at least 45% uh, 40, of government revenues come from agriculture related uh, activities. Over 60% of uh, export earnings Again, from agriculture, you know, tea, coffee, horticulture, uh, over 60% of job creation in the in agri and agri-related uh, uh, sectors. And of course, you know, the larger population is still in the rural areas. Uh, yet, when you look at now investments uh, from a public sector perspective, the government has signed up to the Maputo Declaration, uh, which also was enhanced uh, uh, a few uh, months back committing to investing at least 60% of its budget, budget uh, annual budget to agriculture. But we're not at anywhere near uh, 5%. Actually, in, um, in the last few years, we've seen the budget that the government sort of, sort of like has cutting down uh, or uh, investing uh, less and less uh, to agriculture in terms of, if you look at the overall budget. In the private sector, if you look at the banking sector, uh, in terms of funding, uh, the total uh, uh, funding direct towards uh, agriculture uh, as a percentage of the national credit is less than 5%. So that's really the paradox you're seeing. You see the potential, you see the contribution of agriculture to the, to the economy. Uh, we see the potential for agriculture uh, contributing to uh, rural economic development. But on the other hand, the investment is not commensurate. So, so why? Why is that the case? I think from a public perspective, I think it's really lack of political will and fully appreciating um they do, they do understand they see the they i mean that we've got some really smart policy uh, makers technocrats in the in some of these ministries but i think it's at, at the political level where there's lack of the will to actually allocate uh, these uh, budgets to agriculture what about private investment it all starts with the government coming in to do some basic investments in infrastructure, in um, uh, different areas, to really buy down the level of risk, to really crowd in the private sector investment. But uh, even as we wait for the government to do this, I think the private sector can can be a bit more proactive by really um, uh, innovating. And I think, uh, especially the financial institutions, need to invest more in terms of just really knowledge and understanding the dynamics of the agricultural sector and the different value chains in Kenya and work with partners, you know, NGOs, uh, agricultural companies, off-takers, aggregators, really using different innovative models to try and really push down credit to smallholder farmers. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.